Each man I'm sent to kill speaks cryptic words to me. Each time I come to you and ask for answers. Each time you give only riddles in exchange, but no more. You said the answer to my question would arise when I no longer needed to ask it. So I will not ask. I demand you tell me what binds these men. Uh, what you say is true. These men are connected by a blood oath not unlike our own. Who are they? Non nobis, domine non nobis. Templars. Now you see the true reach of Robert de Salle. All of these men, leaders of cities, commanders of armies, all pledge allegiance to his cause. Their works are not meant to be viewed on their own, are they? But as a whole, what do they desire? Conquest. They seek the Holy Land not in the name of God, but for themselves. What of Richard? Salah Eddin? Any who oppose the Templars will be destroyed. Be assured they have the means to accomplish it. Then they must be stopped. That is why we do our work, Altair. You are restored another rank. Take back your weapon. Use it to bring honor to the Brotherhood. Al Mualim has marked Mejduddin for death. What can you tell me about him? Salahuddin's absence has left the city without a proper leader, and Mejduddin has appointed himself to play the part. Fear and intimidation get him what he wants. He has no true claim to the position. That ends today. You speak too readily. This is not some slaver we're discussing. He rules Jerusalem and is well protected because of it. I suggest you plan your attack carefully. Get to better know your prey. I am sorry, Ahmad. They came without warning. My son? They have my son? What is to be done with him? We did everything we could. What is to be done with him? He's to be executed. Today. No. I won't allow it. But what can we do? Majduddin will hear no appeals. He says there can be no barter with God's will. This is not God's will, but madness. I'll go to him myself. Where is he? He will attend the execution. Perform it even. He enjoys the act. A truly evil man. We have no time to lose then. Let's go. Majduddin understands. He works to cast out the wicked among us, that we may live righteous lives. There is no harm in naming them. Those among you who defy the law. We are nothing without our faith, without its rules and its direction. To defy it is to defy the one who leads us. Such behavior cannot be allowed. You know Mejduddin well? Better than most. He seems a bit too righteous. Is the law really so important to him? What do you think? I think he hides something, and I think you'll tell me what it is. It's a veil. All of it. Men like me, we are meant to scare them, fill the people with fear. The ones he kills, not criminals, but dangerous all the same. Dangerous to who? His plans. Their plans. Yes, he speaks of others. Those he works with. Works for, perhaps. I am uncertain. They need the city, though. Controlling it is important to them. Why? You'll have to ask him yourself. Attend one of his executions. It's when he's most talkative, addressing the crowd, hands covered in blood. Then we are done. Jerusalem's regent Mejduddin is holding a public execution not far from here. It's sure to be well guarded, but it's nothing I can't handle. I know what to do. There is one more thing. One of the men to be executed is a brother. One of us. Al Mulem wishes for him to be saved. Do not worry about the actual rescue. My men will take care of that. But you must ensure Majduddin does not take his life. I won't give him the chance. Silence! I demand silence! People of Jerusalem! Hear me well! I stand here today to deliver a warning. There are malcontents among you. They sow the seeds of discontent, hoping to lead you astray. Tell me, is this what you desire? To be mired in deceit and sin? To live your lives in fear? 
Then you wish to take action? We do! Yes, I guess. Your devotion pleases me. This evil must be purged. Only then can we hope to be redeemed. This is not justice! And all of you stand idle, complicit in this crime. God curse you all! See how the evil of one man spreads to corrupt others? They sought to instill fear and doubt within you, but I will keep you safe! Here now are four filled with sin. The harlot, the thief, the gambler, the heretic. Let God's judgment be brought down upon them all! Temptress, succubus! She goes by many names, but her sin remains the same. She turned her back on the teachings, defiled her body to advance her station. Each man she touched forever stained. This man speaks lies. I am here today not because I laid down with other men, for I did not. He means to murder me because I would not lie down with him. Even now, offered redemption, she continues to deceive. She rejects salvation. Your work here is finished. No, no, it had only just begun. Tell me. What's your part in all of this? Do you intend to defend yourself as the others have and explain away your evil deeds? The Brotherhood wanted the city. I wanted power. There was... an opportunity. An opportunity to murder innocents? Not so innocent. Dissident voices cut deep as steel. They disrupt order. In this, I do agree with the Brotherhood. You'd kill people simply for believing differently than you. Of course not. I killed them because I could. Because it was fun. Do you know what it feels like to determine another man's fate? And did you see the way the people cheered? The way they feared me? I was like a god. You'd have done the same if you could. Such power. Once, perhaps. But then I learned what becomes of those who lift themselves above others. And what is that? Here, let me show you. Jerusalem needs a new ruler.